image that you want to translate now screenshot it on your phone that is even me personally as a coach this is the method i'm presently using all right so it's just as if i'm teaching you the same method that is working for me okay so now, now let me screenshot this now page. automatically it has already translated everything for us even without stressing ourselves now if you want to hello family you're welcome back to my youtube channel in a very quick one we are going to be discussing a very top notch topic when it comes to many importation training which have to do with how you can translate one six eight eight half all right there are a lot of messages there are a lot of um suggestion that i should please record a full tutorial on how you can translate it all right now your it depends on where you get your lectures from what your coach teach you but maybe in some cases you know god created different people and maybe you still find it very difficult to translate this 168 app with this lot of things that you are seeing this chinese thing is really provoking you and you are finding a better and you are finding a better way around it don't worry stick to the end of this video because i'm going to be showing you the three possible ways to translate your 1688 tab to your english all right they are going to be deceiving you that there is a english version of this app on when you go to play store don't mind them oh, there is no english version of 1688 tab we are just trying to patronize these people they love their chinese language they love their language so very much that they cannot even do anything in english do you get it so but in today's method i'm going to be showing you how you can translate it conveniently without hazard at all all right but before we dive into the tutorial properly get to meet me my name is samuel joshua and this is zion of logistics we we'll discuss everything that I have to do with making money online e-commerce facebook adverts instagram adverts most especially on mini importation business we discuss generally you can go through my channel i recorded everything that i have to do with importation business alone so if you are coming across my youtube channel for the very first time please do well to subscribe by joining the community we are also live on tiktok you can follow us on tiktok and on telegram i'm also available for consultation if you are having issues when it comes to your 1688 tab, your importation journey, you don't know anything about shipping company or you're trying to connect your um, 1688 tab to your Alipay, it's got frozen or stuff like that. Anything that have to do with importation at all, please consult me on this number showing on your screen right now. I'll be available to mentor you and i'll be able to, i'll be available to provide solutions to them so you can so you'll be able to do it directly all right and we are also available for early pay funding if you want to fund your early pay we are available for early pay funding and procurement all right so let's dive into it successfully now the first method i'm going to be showing you is using your chrome browser now what you guys don't know about chrome browser is the fact that you can enjoy a streamless english version on 168 on the chrome browser now what do i mean by this let me go to my chrome browser now now this is my chrome browser all right so what i'm going to be doing now is to input the um website of 1688.com I, I want to quickly show you something you know i'm telling you that we have very different methods please just make sure you don't skip any part of this video because i'm going to be make sure you get everything now by the virtue of you doing this you can see here that everything is in chinese right now don't worry i'm going to be showing you how you can navigate through it if you don't understand this chinese you are going to be making use of your chrome browser if you don't have a chrome browser go and download it on your phone 
that's the first thing once you are done downloading it on your phone open it type 1688 come to this where we have this guy here let me try to point it out where we have this guy this guy in um this guy here yeah click on it once you click on it here let me click on it now for you to see you click on it then it comes with automatic translate so it will be able to translate your 1688 app for you without using any external app so everything you want to be doing now you are going to be making use of your google translator that's the first method now so let me click on translate now and it's going to translate everything on this website to english you can see it here everything has been turned to english that's the first thing so if you want to log in you come to my here clicking on my will takes you to the page where you are going to be logging in your details so once you click on login or you just you can just click on any products find your way around it and log in you will definitely enjoy a streamless and easy process to english version all right now that is the first one please if you have any question regarding any of the method that i'm still showing you here drop it under the comment section or you inbox me on whatsapp that's the first method to it now to this second method to it there are some apps that we can use to translate this thing conveniently if we are not the type of people that we know that okay this um first process is not okay for us we are making use of the um the app you know some of us use the app the most and we are still finding it very difficult to translate don't worry let me show you the second process here we are done with the first one here now looking at the second process how do you go about it the second method after we are going to be making use of two different tools so this way prompts us to go to our play store all right this is my play store you are going to be making use of the first one is high translator the first one is i translator here download this app install it on your phone this is this is the i translator and this is what it looks like for those people who are seeing this video for the very first time this is i translator here so you are going to be downloading it once you install it because we have different uh, version of this app on this play store so you are going to install it first the second one you are going to be installing is google translator which i'm going to be showing you now i think i already have it but let me show you how it looks like this is google translator all right now this is what my google translator looks like let me circle it again for you to see what i'm saying this is google translator here so you don't get to download the wrong version of it i've already downloaded the google translator um uh, before on my phone that is what i use all right so once you are done downloading these two apps that is what i'm going to be showing you in a jiffy all right so let's get into the second step now getting to this second step here let's assume i want to buy this um clothes here all right let's assume let me click on the product very well now um okay let me wait for this guy to load up this page so i'll be able to see the full details all right so now you are maybe you are just getting into the business or you want to get a detail about how to translate this page now coming here you don't understand everything that is in chinese here that is written here and you want to find a better means of translating it and getting it don't worry you see this page that you want to translate now screenshot it on your phone that is even me personally as a coach this is the method i'm presently using all right so it's just as if i'm teaching you the same method that is working for me okay so now let me screenshot this page so i'm going to press screenshot now all right i've already screenshot this page so the next thing you want to do now is to go to your the second half that i told you you are going to be downloading which is the google translator this is what it looks like here so i'm going to open my google translator now and this is what i get please you need to make sure you don't skip this part now this is a very important session all right now 
make sure for the very first time make sure this session here is in detected language and make sure where you are translating to is english remember we want to translate chinese to english all right so once that is done you want to open your camera session here where we have this camera here this is where we want to make use of it is called picture translate this method it is called picture translate all right so now i'm going to open this camera here so it's going to automatically open your camera for you all right let me click on it all right this is my camera presently now so you are going to click on your gallery where we have your gallery here this is where we are going to be clicking this is your gallery now once you click on your gallery you will now go to the screenshot you made you click on this screenshot now now automatically it has already translated everything for us even without stressing ourselves now if you want to see it clearly you can easily zoom in to see what this supplier is saying so you will not do this mistake please it is very very important that is why i said you don't want to skip any part of this video now okay now you can read through this without going through any stress at all this is what plus 20 people want to buy and this is what this is the name of the item new comma all right let me see if i can get the name i think this is the new um all right let me just zoom out a little bit so this is just the simple process on how to translate with your google translator remember we are still making use of the second method so this is the specification now once you understand this page now you want to make sure you go back to what to the page in that 168 once you go back there you are still going to be making use of this same process on anything you want to translate now let's assume you've already get this page now you want to scroll down again if you are still even chatting with your supplier this is the method you are going to be using it is very very simple all right now going to the third method which is the last one please before i move to the third session i beg you if you are the type of people that watch video and you don't subscribe I believe so far you have gained one or two things and you have already um you've already gained a lot of things so far please i beg you i'm on my new subscribe like that button and share it to your students please i'm begging you okay let's proceed to the final stage this final stage is also applicable to those people who want to translate so please make sure you don't skip this part too now this is a special um app now i'm going to be taking you through the process now this is the app we have the high translator here you can see it here this is where i'm presently pointing at all right this is the google translator app um high translator this is what we are going to be making use of okay so you want to open it there are some settings you need to do before you can make use of this app okay so now you can see it here just click on this one here is a welcome message once it's downloading it will takes you to the next one so you can see here you are going to be clicking on grant permission here because we need to install it is one to is the one that want to help us to translate so once you click on that install you are going to be seeing it here it will take you to this page so now this is what you are going to be clicking here where we have high translator make sure on your app you see something like high translator there so you want to toggle it on once you toggle it on you want to go back here all right so once you go back here you are going to accept again then you are still going to be turning this i translator on again so you want to come to your i translator here you want to turn it on then you want to click on allow allow so once you click on allow you want to turn this on again so you want to click on got it so now automatically this app has already have access to overflow now now i'm going to be showing you something you want to click on allow so with this we are done with the settings but before then let's change our language from indie to detected language or 
to english remember we are translating from china to english so we are going to be changing it to english let me click on it now then you scroll down a little bit and look for chinese so you can see chinese here no that's not the taiwan chinese i need the simplified version all right so this is the simplified version here this is it so you click on it so you can see here that you've already clicked on it and automatically you have access now you can see that this toggle has already turned on in this corner here so you can make use of it you are just going to tap on this toggle to translate anything you want to translate all right so let's go to our 1688 app to see this to see how this um google translator works okay so let's wait for this uh, page to load please i'm begging you subscribe and comment below the reason why we always say you guys should comment below and like this video is the fact that youtube seo will be able to recommend this video to other people so please don't just watch alone like and also share among your students then comment if this video is helpful i beg you please I beg. All right. So now let's proceed. So you are going to be clicking on this guy now. Now we want to translate, right? We want to translate. So this guy here is what we are going to be making use of. So I click on it now. So you can see after clicking on it, this um this guy showed up, right? So what you are going to be doing now is anywhere you want to anywhere you want to translate, you are going to be dragging this guy. To the place now what do i mean let me drag it now i've already long press on it now i want to translate this guy here you will see what i'm saying now let's wait it's still presently loading now you can see bravo it has automatically translates what this page really looks like now you can see that this method is quite different from the third um the second method we use we are not going outside of 168 tab and we are translating everything once you are done translating, just leave it and cancel. It will automatically go directly. Now, let's scroll down and see translate another thing. You are still going to click on it. Then do what? Long press and drag it to where you want to translate. So, let me just translate this guy. Let me see. Okay, let me translate this guy. So, you can see here, this is one color, five pieces optional. All right? So, this is just the simple method the three different methods you can use to translate all of the 1688 tab itself and funny enough this three method is applicable on all the chinese websites including taobao and pindodo and idle fish or any other chinese website all right so i believe you've already gained one or two things in watching this very video today please subscribe to our youtube channel all right so i'm going to be leaving you with this video on how you are not going to be paying for any local shipping fee at all on 168 it is cancelled so it's going to be showing somewhere around this corner and you can also check the description button of this video to watch the full video all right so thank you guys for watching this video to the very end i will see you in my next tutorial